making it out and goofy. With no encounters. Hold fast. This be a bumpy ride. It's fine. I'll get on here. Everything's bumpy. At least you didn't have to like run out under a time limit. Oh, isn't he? He kind of just, yeah, he actually disappeared in front of our eyes. Oh, yeah. You're wrong, Galif? Yeah, we gotta get moving. And now. Well, I guess what his memory's back. It's, it's been more of a urgency. It all came back to me. I remember everything. Ekstef is an evil warlock from my world. Oh, yeah, of course. 30 years ago, he came here to destroy this world's crystals. I and three others, the Dawn Warrior, sealed him with the power of the crystal. Everything was fine for 30 years. We thought it was all over. Yet here we are. But something bad has happened to the crystals. Once we figured it out, we took the meteors that came back here. But I was too late. Extef's not only been freed, but has returned to our world. That's because we used so much for the crystal's power, right? No, we were the ones who left Xtef on this world in the first place. Back then, we should have dragged them back to our world, like he said. So you guys are really going back? Yep. We've got the COX stuff again. Ryo's meteorite should have... So, so, should have some juice left in it. Probably only enough for one more trip, though. Bart, Lena, Ferris. Thank you so much for everything. I miss you guys. What kind of nonsense is that? We're going with you. No, you're not. This is the last meteorite. That means if you went back to my world, you'll never be able to come back here. Farewell. Goodbye. Is it Cryo? Is it Cryo? I don't know. Arch. Yeah. So we've been talking. We're still fighting x in the outer world, and we got to avenge the paw. Yeah, so what's more, Galif, he's... He's one of us. Arts, we knew you get it. Let's go, then, to the other world. But how? The meteorites don't have enough power to warp anywhere. Well, I, when I think of meteorites, I think Sid. He'll probably know something. Yeah. I was not intending that to be a cutscene, but since, uh... started another one, I have a clear direction of where to go next. Why not? Because I have a feeling we won't be able to come back here after this next story beat, you know? Um, 
I think so. Oh, did they leave a note? It's in Sid's hat writing. I demand to you left over from the airship renovations is dangerous. Went to return it. Oh, I hope nothing has happened to them. Turn to Adamandiite? That means... Yeah, I gotta head back to, uh... The first meteorite that fell? I think. Oh, right. How did he get there? <laughs> the other ship is still here. I don't know. They found a way. Maybe the chocobo is it still there? Yeah, they probably used the chocobo. It was just one. out. I guess correctly. Sid, Mid, what are you guys? Arch stay back, it's dangerous. A huge wave of power just started flowing from the adamantite. Just start to put it back where it came from. Hold on. Jumping Christmas, the floor is absorbing the energy from the anima animantiite. Oh. Say, do you think the meteorite could be recharging? Perhaps it'll be enough for us to travel to Scalos world. That's as good as good as idea as any. Ah, uh, yeah, shite. Sounds like a good sounds like a good idea. <laughs> what are you going on about? Hmm. So that's your plan. This piece of adamantite is too small. It's not enough power for this meteorite to get you to the other world. But maybe if all four meteorites' powers are combined, it'll be enough to warp to Gallus' world. Alright, let's get to the next meteorite. Is there a strict order I need to do? I suppose that's a, that's a thing. If I actually had beef this entire time, I would have gotten used to that move. And <laughs> if the, uh, the old man was a thief, I would have would have sucked for him to leave. So if I just get used to going slowly, then it should be fine. landed at top of the wind wyvern. Wait here, leave it to wash. Catch that. Okay, let's hurry. Sid, mid, look out. <laughs> Need to be some excitement in this, I guess. Eh? 
Okay, that, that sucked. No, that was not good. Always oh, that how you okay, I guess you were able to Oh Set of rice also maxes out their HP, I think, so not good at all. Oh, good. Very good. A minute and a half. Sure. I just waste all my Phoenix Downs that I've <laughs> collected. In case. Oh, three times a charm. has been the most annoying fight. <laughs> They're like done protect everyone, I guess. I don't know. That's pretty much what I had to do. Just cast protecting everyone. Oh, not of MP. Good. Very good.
And yeah, that's still hers, but like that's that's livable now. <laughs> uh survivable. Had I actually healed Ferris. Oh well. Phoenix Downs. Pretty fun. No more MP. Good. No more MP. Just in case. Not even enough MP to self-destruct. Very nice. Wow, that was annoying. <laughs> Are you alright? That was awesome. Alright. Let's get to the next meteorite, please. Hopefully it's not another fight. There probably will be. Gotta go to an, to an end. Man. Uh, I guess we could head to the one that uh, could teleport. Save because I was actually pretty worried about losing <laughs> everything there. Come on, mid, yeah. I mean, maybe you could have done that. Or came in, so we didn't have to wait. I don't know. That just be. Bazooks, it's a den of monsters. Uh, you kids go on ahead. Great. Blizzard. Match damage, okay, keep doing that. I say I'm pretty worried about a very strong retaliation. Okay. Well. <laughs> Ooh, new summon. And I think that's the uh, final summon I saw uh, before we could go to the next part of the game. Much obliged. Now, you can leave the rest to us. Take your dead friends <laughs> and heal them. Alright, let's get to the next meteorite. Uh, 